always remember this moment. Photo bomb. Photo hog. <laughs> It feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Like it needs another one. I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch, Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. If I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. I wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. Oh, does the schoolgirl have a test today? I'm starting to feel like going to Blackwell every day is a test. I just need to get on my regular school schedule again. Okay, I need to get dressed now. I think I'll be moshing today. Hmm. I still feel guilty for not busting out of here to stop David from hitting Chloe. this old phone? We decorated it together. The fact that she put the photo next to Rachel is so touching. That was my 10th birthday. I didn't know Chloe kept this stuff. Quartz. Can I check out the news on this old laptop? Oh, at least we haven't been identified. Yet. Vorfall. Polizei und Feuerwehr reagierten auf einen Einbruch und einen Fall von Vandalismus auf dem Campus der Blackwell Akademie um 1.30 Uhr morgens. Die Polizei hat noch keine Angaben zu möglichen Verdächtigen gemacht. Vorfall. Die Polizei verhaftete einen nackten Mann mit Schwert am Up All Night Donuts in der Nähe der Peckingpa Road um 20.52 Uhr. Der noch nicht identifizierte Mann stand unter dem Einfluss von Energy Drinks und Meta... Metamphetamin. Ähm, er bleibt bis zum Abschluss der Ermittlungen ohne Möglichkeit auf Kaution in Haft. I have to go. Especially since Kate's parents aren't going to bury her here. Beerdigung einer Blackwell-Schülerin. Eine öffentliche Zeremonie für Kate Marsh, 18, am Dienstag verstorben, wird um 14 Uhr am Samstag, den 12. Oktober, abgehalten. Die Familie bittet um Spenden an ihre Kirchengruppe mit Blackwell als Mittelsmann. Die Familie plant eine private Zeremonie und die Beerdigung an einen anderen Ort. I was such a wuss to cower in the closet while David hit her. Ugh, still reeks like a chlorine factory. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hole. I thought Chloe might put up a pic of me instead. Can't compete with Rachel. Holy shitballs. Frank is scary. 
I should have let Chloe take that money. I love this morning light. It's so peaceful. Wouldn't it be wicked if we could just hang out here forever like when we were kids? Yes, but sadly we're not kids anymore. At least you can date now, right? My dad was terrified of the day I would discover boys. As Blackwell proves, boys are trouble. And way fucking gross, as you'll discover soon enough. Oh, okay, woman of the world. Please tell me what it's like to get that first magic kiss. Sorry, sorry. Didn't mean to get you all worked up. I just don't think anybody is good enough for you. Besides me. I don't think I'll be moshing today. Ja, wo soll ich denn sonst Klamotten finden? So. Okay. Time for some Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size. But not quite my style. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second-guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? I double dare you. Kiss me now. Okay. Damn, you're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. Unless he's into girl and girl action. You're such a dork. Oh man, that was priceless when I kissed Chloe. She didn't think I would. Ja, aber du hast sie überrascht. Das spule ich jetzt nicht zurück. <lacht> Looking sick, Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka bra? Maybe not. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to, uh, wake and bake first. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out, okay? Oh my god, that smells so amazing. Okay. It's like when we were kids here. Chloe has had this damn dirty pirate towel since we were kids. <laughs> Serious flashback. Chloe never used to care when I borrowed her toothbrush. What's ironic is I always hated it when Chloe used my toothbrush. It feels so good to wash my face after all that chlorine and hiding. You know, I haven't gone through a dyeing my hair blue phase yet. Maybe it's time. Check out Mad Max, <laughs> ready to fucking thrash. 
I'm so hardcore. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel! Uh, uh, I mean, Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. I'm dying for some of your famous pancakes. I thought you would have missed those. Ah, you ate more than William. And he loved them. <laughs> I remember. We would erase each other to grab them from the stack. So this time, you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the eggs and milk. Eggs and milk? No problem. Uh, Kühlschrank. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. Nein. Oder sind die draußen? Moment, Eier und Milch? Milch? Achso, okay. Now for the mother's milk. Kate's life was sure worth a nice exploitive headline. Who drinks beer this early around here? Ja, dreimal darfst du raten. Three dead birds lined up? That's fucking ominous. I remember when Chloe and me would take turns in the swing. We would push each other so hard we'd fly way up in the air. Chloe always wanted to swing all the way around. I always got scared and would jump off before I flew off. And Chloe is still trying to get high. I wonder how these birds died. Oh, dead bird. Poor thing. Hmm. So, wir brauchen immer noch die Milch, <coughs> die wir aber warum auch immer nicht vom Kühlschrank holen können. Oh, jeez, can you help me get this bird out of here? Was für ein Vogel? Hallo? Was für ein Vogel? Vogel? Ach da! Hallo Vögelchen! Be gone! Fly, you fool! Es wäre aber vielleicht intelligenter, erstmal die Tür zu öffnen. Nein, nicht rausgehen! Hallo! Ist sie doof oder was? Du sollst die Tür nur öffnen. Oh, look at the poor bird. He seems kind of freaked out. Okay, kann ich das hier öffnen? Ja, perfekt. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. Oh, 
Oh, dann drehen wir halt noch eine Ehrenrunde. Ich hätte natürlich auch zurückspulen können. Wenn ich so clever gewesen wäre. So, ach so, die Milch hatte ich schon, aber die Eier, ach, da sind die Eier, okay. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but... We are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. I hate to even think this, much less say it out loud, but... I think Rachel is in serious trouble. I know. I watch those awful true crime shows and it makes me ill if I think about Rachel ending up on one. So I don't think too much. I see why Chloe is so obsessed with finding her. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. <laughs> you think? Then why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Doubt it. Um, did she really? Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me what, a century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> Go sit at the table. Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Kate's life was sure worth a nice exploitive headline. Ja, kann ich denn noch irgendwie aufstehen? Seeing you again. Ah, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Wow, sir. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this, and, and... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. 
She was hopeful, positive. Everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please. It's too early to start picking a fight. Heed instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Uh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me. I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now, who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. <laughs>